Hey guys, what's happening? Make sure to hit on that subscribe button before I forget to say that in this video. Also, make sure to rate by giving this video a thumbs up. Not a thumbs down, but a thumbs up. And commenting on this video by telling me whether you like this theme or you don't like this theme. Give me some feedback, all that other stuff. I have my own website now, so make sure to go to my YouTube channel. I have a link there on my... Um, profile about my pro profile or you can just click on the link in the description below of this video it will not be showing the 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 links in the description um, below if you are running in an iDevice sorry for those people but anyways if you're using Safari then um, then it will show the links in the description below. Yeah, so basically, I'm gonna have the source for this um, for this theme. So you just have to get it for free, not for one ninety nine as usual. So you can get this theme for free, and yeah. Also, I will be putting down my website, as I said, and I will be putting down my new YouTube channel in the description below, where I will be. You know, talking um, on in on my microphone while doing some gameplay with my friends on Steam or my cousins on Steam or like on Minecraft and all that other stuff that you um, people like to watch nowadays. Yeah. So basically, um, if you didn't know already, in my last video I talk about I I was talking about um, a new segment and all that stuff and I um, told you in the future which is today that um, I'm gonna be doing a review on an 8-bit theme so it sounds it looks pretty cool it sounds pretty cool um, and yeah and I'm just, just gonna be doing a review on it so as I said if you want to get this theme for free make sure to add that source in the description below it is just to tell you repo.insaleni.com so you do put down the right source or link and yeah so it looks really nice even for the icons that do not have the customized um um, I can't display them saying I'm a lot. I'm just really excited. I was just really excited for this theme. And yeah, it looks really retro-like. It gets rid of the... The dock. But it still keeps the reflection. And yeah, it has a really nice look for the default icons. For the other icons, it does ha also have a themed look to it also. Except for the Cydia icons, of course. Um, but for the actual Cydia icon, it does have a theme on it. But for the rest, it won't. And for some of the default ones, like FaceTime or Reminders, or iPod, that application right there, it will not be um, showing you a themed look on it. Um, if you want to get this unified iPod Touch, um, icon, I will be doing a tutorial on it, um, next, next week, because next week I'm going to be doing an app of the week video, but anyways, yep, so yeah, it looks really nice, though, and as I said, for the icons that don't have the cool looking display, it actually does have like a grid look to each icon, so it does make it look kind of retro still, and it has it in a square image, which looks really nice for most of these icons, except for the um, city app icons that you can get, city apps that you can get in city, of course. Yeah, it looks really nice, and if you do like this theme, as I said, the source is in the description below. If you do not know how to add a source, all you need to do Open up Cydia, go and go to the Manage tab, go to Sources, hit on Edit, which is on the top right corner. Hit on Edit, after hit on Add, which is right beside it, and just enter in the source that I'll have in the description below. 
So yeah, that's about it, guys. Peace out, and I will see you on my next YouTube video.